your eyes hurt, right? <laughs> Hello, tiny reviewer friends. Today I'll be reviewing my first Maker's Cray from Kiwi Co. I reviewed Tinker, Doodle, and I reviewed Eureka Crates, but I've never um, made a Maker Crate before. Obviously, you must have recognized this whitish blob. It's a sticker that came with the way you took it off, and apparently it did not come off all the way, so that's why it's kind of still blobbed. Um, so this maker's crate is going to be electroluminescent sculptures. Bend and twist wire to create an illuminating piece of art for ages 14 and up. Obviously, I am currently 10 years old and I am not 14. I'm not a teenager right now. But I love the Eureka crate and the Eureka crate was the same age as 14 and up. So that's why I decided to do a maker crate. Alright, so I took the tape off. So I'm going to take this thing out. Okay. We're gonna, be making, we're gonna be making something like this. Pretty neat, right? Ooh, and when you light them up, it looks like these. That's pretty cool. And here's the direction that are needed for it. Alright, so what is this? Is that it? Oh, this must be a template that you can use in order to make some little sketches. There are some heavy duty something. Washi tape, I know that. Batteries. A series of knobs and ooh, these are, must be the wires that are used some string wire cutters wire bending tool battery pack that looks like a walkie-talkie to me at least to me some tape and stickers the le no these are like caps or something i don't know there's a wooden face and huh new color tissue paper it's either gold, green, and now it's pink. Box out of the way. So, of course, let's check out the instructions. So, if you've seen... Oh, these are other maker crates. These are other maker crates. Make baskets, cute little designs. Painting. This is ours. You can make, you know, bandanas for dogs and cushions. But, like, if you've seen my other cute code videos, I'm not going to be explaining every single thing that we're doing. Instead, I am going to be fast forwarding it and you'll see me at the end of the video when it is time for me to show you how it works. Ooh. Other pieces of art. The history of wire art. These are like a dozen templates that you can use to make, but I don't think we really, wait, we do need it, but let's check some of them out, okay? Before I fast forward in like two minutes or something. There's like several of these templates. Hmm, that's a tree. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> okay, so now it looks like me that's gonna be wrapped inside the paper. There's trees. Out. A leaf. Or at least that's what I think it is. Quickly take it out. Oh, there's even a template at the back side of it. That looks like somewhat of a cat. There, there's lots of series of items that I don't even know what I'm going to be doing right now. But first, let's take everything out before I get confused with it. And then I promise you I'll fast forward it. I'm not going to be explaining this all the time. I'm not going to make an unusual cute video. That's the wooden base. Let's take out the wire bending tool. This is the wire bending tool, not the wire cutters. Let's see what the wire bending tool looks like. Is this what you call a wire bending tool? And it's also wrapped in bubble wrap, so. And of course, you're gonna need that. So this is the wire bending tool, but whatever that is. So it looks like these are the pegs that if you want to bend the wire, like small loops, you can put it here and you can wrap it around. If you want big ones, you can take these big ones out. Kind of have to keep this pegboard in mind. <laughs> All right, and this is the, why am I keeping this anyway? This is the wire cutting tool. If I can take it out, that is out, please. I wonder why it doesn't come out that easily, but, oh, no wonder. Duh. Ooh, I have my own set of pliers. My daddy uses these. <laughs> and then we'll take them off when it's needed. Okay, now I'm promising I'm going to be fast forwarding it. Dude, where's the instructions? Is the instructions this one? But what, where's the instructions? 
That's not the instruction, daddy. There's no such thing as an instruction here. Wait, what? Is this something like rude? Oh my gosh, so I'm supposed to do this on my own? Am I really supposed to do this on my own? Really? How do you expect me to do this on my own? We learned that there are no instructions coming with the crate, so you have to go to a video instruction on Kiwico website, and that's how you need to learn how to make this. So, Daddy, do I do a tutorial or do I do fast forward? Of course, you do fast forward. I don't know why I asked him that, but. We are in the bathroom right now, and here is my art. So where you can see bits of light shining on the blacked out area because you don't need all the light, it's because I put the washi tape a little loosely and a bit thin, so that's why you can see bits of light, and I like this texture. So that's the just mode, and then blinking on and off, and even faster. <clears throat> Your eyes hurt, right? <laughs> And, and once to turn it off. Nope. <laughs> That's better. So, yeah, really there should be like all the way here. But I blacked it out because you don't need that much light. So I put washi tape around it and it turned out pretty well. Well, that's it for today. If you enjoyed this KiwiCo video, please subscribe and press the like button. And meet me again on this brown table. And I'll see you. Uh, brown table next time, but right now we're in the bathroom. And I'll see you guys again in my other videos. Bye.